So you can think of a shipping profile like a box for different kinds of products. You can have a cupcake shipping profile with the standard rates for uh, light packages. Then you can create a pie power profile for your dedicate pies with more secure shipping option. Maybe even a flat rate since they're all similar in size. And now let's say you run a book store on Shopify and sell a variety of books with with different uh, weights and sizes. And here's how you can use custom shipping rates to cater to your customers, to cater to your customers. So we're going to have to go to settings here. And then here we have shipping and delivery. And then here we have custom shipping rates. I can click now on new profile. And then here we can add a pro product. Now, of course, here, let's say you have a paper, reserve paper. That's your first custom shipping rate. And then you can apply to all orders with only paper bags uh, with a different kind of like a weight limit. And you have a flat rate of five for domestic shipping, uh, let's say five dollars. Uh, so here we can create a zone and I want only to sell this product in, not in Romania, but only in, in, um, let's say in United States done. All right. And add some custom, um, let's add now some cap, add some rate, a rate. And here, maybe I'm going to add the uh, custom flat rate, shipping, uh, shipping rate, custom, custom rate name. So I can add, uh, I can write here the, let's say this is for some t-shirts. I already changed kind of the name <laughs> tension, made it to order. The price is uh, 25. Uh, 100 whatever currency you can add additional pricing and you can click on done and that's pretty much it now you can create a zone of course and I'll also shipping zone in uh, only Austria maybe you know so you have here the you can add the rates again here and or another another one and here now you have shipping zone you can also remove this one don't want to and create another one and manage your products and here the name and uh, let's say this is for some t-shirts now let's click on create and I already have here three shipping rates so yeah, I hope you found this uh, short video helpful. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more tutorials.